Welcome, welcome. Thank you for stopping by at my trial. Um, today we're going to make um, blueberry mousse shooter. Blueberry mousse shooter, or if you want to call it blueberry panna cotta. Okay, let's start it. Um, so first you're going to need um, powdered sugar and also um, blueberry puree. Okay, let's get started off. So first you're going to need um, 34 grams of gelatine and you're going to need powdered sugar. You're going to need 255 grams and also raspberry puree, uh, that's our blueberry puree. You're going to need um, 1062.5 grams of blueberry um, puree. All right, whipped cream, you're gonna need the same amount as the blueberry. Um, so 1,062.5 um, grams of whipped cream. So if you wanna calculate this and do a smaller batch, you can do so. So, all right, let's start it off. So you're gonna need, of course, um, gelatin. You're gonna blue me gelatine. I'm making a big batch, so um, I blue me gelatine in some cold ice water. And the batch that I gave you, trying to remember, um, that's a smaller batch comparing to this batch. So um, it's a very small amount that I gave you this a while ago. This recipe, um, but if you want to make this batch a bigger you can basically times that to the amount that you need. So um, so basically you're gonna um, blue me gelatine in cold ice water, heat up your puree, add the powder sugar to the puree, mix it all the way out, then you don't, you don't have any chunks. Once you heat it up, then you're gonna add your gelatine, all right. Once you still mix and make sure there's there are no chunks in there because sometimes the gelatine is not sink all the way to the bottom of the cold ice water. So, you know, you want to look out for that. Once that mix all the way, then you're going to um, need to um, put aside your cream, which is heavy cream. You're going to mix your heavy cream to a soft peak. And if you watch this video, I'm going to show you um, how I get my cream to mix as mix the soft peak, the, the type of um, cream that I use. If you want to would like to know, I would definitely uh, more and like more for sure. give you that um, answer because, you know, I don't want to call out the names on my channel. Um, so you mix your cream to a soft peak. And this is the, the heavy cream um, mixing this cream. If you mix it is um, three and four, you can add it to speed two, slowly add your cream. Once you slowly add your cream, um, as you can see that my texture of my cream is just, they just start doing it. Once it um, does reach the soft peak, it's gonna get white, whiter. So that's the soft peak of my cream. And that's where you want to mix it. After you mix it, then you're going to slowly um, add all of, I would, would say you should just slowly add every, add all of the blueberry um, mixture and gelatin to the heavy cream um, soft beet that you, you mix. So add everything here. And once you add everything here, then you're gonna basically fold it in. If you wanna use a scraper or you wanna use a spatula, um, you can do so. But for me, I didn't wanna dump my hand in there because, um, so I just basically take my time and just fold the cream, fold it from the bottom all the way to the top. Once you fold that in, you wanna make sure you do not over mix this. So at this moment, I finished with my cream. I'm gonna make a demo for you. I wanna show you what's the texture and what's the look, how it's gonna look. So I just top it off um, with um, my my blueberry mousse and then I slowly um, 
halfway in the glass then I'm gonna place this in the freezer if you see the glass is kind of very um, mercury a little bit it's from the frost that I have in, in the, um, the refrigerator um, then I top it off with a little jelly on top and for the jelly you can just add some sugar and um, a sheet of gelatine and you get that jelly on top then after I do that then I top it off with the whipped cream so once I add the whipped cream on top um, then I add some blueberries once I add my blueberry you can decorate it any type of way you want um, wherever way you want you can decorate it because um, this way is uh, just want to do it kind of natural so you see um, the looks of the cream so you know, think about you know like I have to do a demo once I start doing this recipe I'm like okay all right may, might as well I just don't want to just like give you a recipe and you don't know how it's gonna look like so I just mix it you know give you a tutorial how to you know mix it um, very unique and you know nice so you ha see the whole picture of the the whole mousse so I top it off with some flowers and I want to say thank you so much I really appreciate you watching this channel please like share and subscribe if you think this video was very helpful for you um, thank you so much and um, see you in the next one and that's the final stage of my blueberry mousse panna cotta um, it's beautiful thank you so much you have a wonderful day all right peace